Hi, Sean Connor here. If you're using an older version of M3 like this 7.1, they made some changes the way that consolidation works with purchase orders. It used to be you would have this consolidation fence and then there were a, a set of fields that all had to match in order to club those on one purchase order when you release them. About five years ago they actually made a change to that though and in your current version of M3 there's now a consolidation group PO field that can be configured and if we drill into that you'll see you now can set the flags for how your purchase orders will consolidate so if you want to release 1000 items and you want a purchase order by warehouse you would have this set and <clears throat> If, you're, if you use priorities and want to split them by priority, you would have this set. Buyer is one where often a lot of companies will split purchase orders by buyer. Whatever your criteria was, you would set that up on your consolidation group, and then you would default that in PPS095 to your order type. So if you're currently having split purchase orders now, this is probably the reason why this isn't configured correctly. Or maybe you want to get creative and create multiple types of these and apply them to multiple different purchase order settings. Hey, thanks for looking at this quick video. Some of these videos may seem a bit random, but as I'm configuring things, just shoot a quick video on that in case anyone else is inquiring about the same kind of thing. Thanks for checking out my video today. Have an amazing day.